What's up everybody? It's Normal DK. And I'm just here with a little update video. I know it's not Saturday. Um, I just wanted to uh, address something that happened on my channel. I believe uh, a week ago. And that door looks weird. Yeah, it's in the wrong place. Um, I just want to address something that happened on my channel about a week ago. So, it was my birthday uh last friday and i was going to celebrate by starting up a new lp new super ugh, new super mario brothers u and uh i was going to have a video on friday and a video on monday because i was going to do uh cheese excuse me i was going to do um super mario brothers u every monday and then like a normal video every Saturday. So those are going to be two. Okay, you know what? Forget this. Oh, wait, this... <laughs> what is going on? You know what? Forget this door. Um, I was going to do a video basically twice a week. With new Super Mario Brothers U every Monday. And a normal, normal DK video on Saturday. And I was really excited about it. I had so many episodes of uh, Super Mario Brothers U recorded. And uh, I went to go upload the first episode. Everything was uh, running real smoothly. And then I went to go check uh, if it was done processing so I can change the thumbnail. And then Nintendo said, hey, <laughs> your video has been content ID. And if you don't know what that means, if your video gets content ID, that means the, um, the publisher of that game basically makes money off of your video. Um, they put ads on your video and they get the revenue uh, that part didn't bother me because I don't make that much money on YouTube anyway so I was like and eh, it's alright but the big problem is uh, if you get too many content IDs uh, you can either lose features on your channel or you can lose your channel altogether so I really didn't want to risk Losing the channel just for a Super Mario Brothers ULP, a game that came out almost a year ago. Um, but I really did want to play it, don't get me wrong. But it's just that I don't want to risk my channel being shut down because of that LP. Now, the thing is, Nintendo, I think around, I, I don't know, five months ago, um, they started doing this to a lot of people who do Nintendo Let's Plays or videos that uh have their content in it and uh, it hasn't affected a lot of people but the people it has affected really affected them and those are the people who do um nintendo lps they do sh just just nintendo lps um there's a lot of nintendo lps i'm subscribed to that uh seems to not have you know not much to complain about it's like they still love Nintendo, but they wish they didn't, you know, enforce this rule or whatever. Um, and a lot of people, this is their jobs. So it, it really affects them because if they can't do uh, Nintendo videos, which they're known to do, and then, you know, they can't get money or revenue off of it. And uh, that's how they make a living. And it's kind of, it sucks for them. But um, I, I did hear that uh that Nintendo lifted this so that's why I felt more comfortable doing the Super Mario Brothers ULP because I was like okay then I, I guess Nintendo doesn't care anymore apparently that's not the case because I still got content ID for uh, Mario U so I, I don't know I, I have no idea really what's going on Nintendo really hasn't said what's really happening um it's weird and uh you know, I, I feel bad for the people who just do Nintendo uh, content videos because, you know, they they choose Nintendo all over, you know, Sony and Microsoft. Um, and, and, that, and they just, they just, I don't know, it's just they love Nintendo and they rather do Nintendo videos. Um, and now that Nintendo came out and said, hey, you, you're not going to make money off of this, it sucks. It really does. Um... I have seen some uh, LPs that do like just Nintendo LPs, like Chuka Conroy. He start he he just did uh, Sonic Colors, which is a Sega game. Uh, so I don't know if he's gonna start branching out into other uh, 
other third party games, but I don't know. But it's a, uh, it's just you know you got to be careful when doing let's plays and stuff like that. Uh, a lot of LPers are basically dancing on eggshells, and it's a fear they have every time they upload a new video: is is this going to get content ID, or am I going to get a strike on my channel and uh, lose all my subscribers, all my videos, all the hard work? You know, it's it's being an LP on YouTube. I guess is the hardest hardest thing to do on YouTube, and uh, you always have the risk of losing your channel or uh, not making any money off of it if it's your only source of income. But um, the title of the video says "No More Nintendo LPs." I don't know because if you guys remember, I did. Nintendo Land, and uh, I did, what, three episodes, three or four episodes of Nintendo Land, and I had never gotten a content ID on those. I did Super, Super Smash Brothers Brawl, I didn't get a content ID on that. Uh, I also, I recorded a lot, a lot of videos, uh, and they're Nintendo games. They're not, you know, first party Nintendo games, but they're, they're, they're on the GameCube or on the Wii, and I'm afraid that, um... Those will get content ID too, and I'll you know get another sh strike, and it's 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 real confusing right now. I'm gonna do a little bit more research on it, and uh, and really see what's going on. Uh, but for now, um, I don't know, guys. I I think I'm gonna stick to just Xbox games. Um, I think I might be doing a lot of uh, GTA Five videos, so uh, keep an eye out for that because I know. Take Two and Rockstar was like, you know, it's okay to do LPs on Grand Theft Auto Five. It's just that, you know, the best thing to do was have your uh, have the radio turned off so you don't get any copyright. You know, the music uh, is always going to be copyright no matter what Rockstar or Take Two says. You got to be careful of music. So I might be doing a lot of Grand Theft Auto Five videos. I've seen a lot on YouTube. Uh, I'm surprised people aren't burned out on the game already, but. That my that's that what I, that is what I might be doing here uh, on my channel. Uh, just a quick, quick, quick update. I could be launching two new channels very soon. I'm not going to say much about it, uh, but there could be two new channels coming in the next few months or the beginning of 2014. So um, yeah, I'm really excited to launch these channels. I'm going to do uh, my best to make these channels 10 times better than normal DK hopefully fingers crossed um, don't worry I'll still be uh, uploading on normal DK I'll just have uh, two extra channels or I might just have one we'll see I really haven't decided yet um, but yeah I guess I'll see you guys in the next video uh, this Saturday I think I will be uploading um, a uh, oh, what? <laughs> sorry uh, it's been a while since I recorded the video. I'm trying to remember the We Shop channel video uh, for you guys out there who are thinking about getting, you know, a used Wii that are really they're really cheap now. And uh, and you know what, you 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 can get some really good classic games on the uh, the the old We Shop channel if you don't have a Wii U. There's a lot of games out there that you I think you would like to have if you picked up the Wii, uh, the first gen Wii. So uh, that was just a quick little update. And, um, once again, I don't know, we'll, we might do another Nintendo, uh, project. It's just that these are not vines, I don't think, so I can't climb them. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Lost train of thought. Um, what was I saying? Oh, the Nintendo thing. Yeah, but who knows? We, we might, uh, do another Nintendo, Nintendo Let's Play. Uh, we will, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Um... But for now, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video.